morning everybody welcome back to another vlog i'm cracking on with these vlogs i'm absolutely loving being off for the holidays because i've just been managing to get so much done like loads i've been so active on instagram tiktok and i've been filming for youtube and i just feel like i'm in my prime again i've just missed it so much so i'm back vlogging again today i didn't vlog anything yesterday but i thought you know what i've got some plans for the next two days so let's do like a two-day vlog we're starting off strong with going to get the hair done i cannot wait I am so excited to have my hair done. Uh, I think, I can't even remember the last time I went for it done. It was like mid year last year, I think. So it's, in fact, it's probably about a year since I last had it done. It's been a long time. I was actually booked in three months ago and then my midwife appointment ended up being on the day that I was booked in. So I had to cancel and then there was no room for three months because Chantelle is the hair queen so it gets booked up super super quick so um, yeah it's finally here I'm so excited to go and get it done. It's very rare I go and have my hair done actually I go like probably once a year. I sometimes like booking for it cutting but colouring wise um, it's probably about once a year because I don't get anything drastic done so the roots never look majorly bad uh, but you can definitely tell it's ready for a good freshen up so i'm not going for anything drastic today i just want a good trim uh, i'm keeping the length so i'll just show you my hair is quite long and it's very very thick you probably can't see because i've got a black outfit on but here's the hair at the minute um i've got like some layers in the back Try and speak up so you can hear me um and you can't really tell the color of it i might have to like put a before photo in if chantelle takes one um but it's it just needs a good freshen up that's all it needs and then these bits at the front originally i had like them super short to like come down and i do want them short again i think i'm just gonna get it like up to here or something just get those cut off not majorly short and i'm just so excited for a good pamper my favorite bit is where the wash your hair and do your massage oh i just could fall asleep in that moment and then after that i'm going to meet up with mum jesse and my brother um to go to the farm which is so exciting jesse actually went to this farm last week for the first time and he loved it so much so we're going back today i've never been and it's literally around the corner from my house so i'm excited to take him there and then we've got nothing planned tonight and then tomorrow night me and Jimmy are going out. Obviously not out because I'm 24 week pregnant. Um, <laughs> but we're going um, out with all our friends to like a little, it's called Supper Club. It's in Elsica if anyone, you've probably all heard of it if you're from the area because it's become super popular now. But it's basically like all these different food vendors um, like, oh there's this amazing food and you can have some drinks and there's like bands on and stuff. So we're going there tomorrow night. Obviously I'm not drinking for obvious reasons. Um, but I'm going to do like a little get ready with me and probably make my skin look a bit more presentable than I do right now. My hair will be done. Jimmy's here, ready for work. He's working like next to me this morning, aren't you? I am. <laughs> you're going to bend down. You're going to bend down so they can see you. You can't see me. <laughs> you can't see your head. Um, <laughs> yeah, he's, he's working like where I'm going for my hair doing this morning. Yep. So I was thinking he can bring me food and drinks. I'm going to cut your hair <sighs> and colour it. Pink. Oh, is anyone else's boyfriend just a total wind up? I know I've got grey hair, I know, and also I've got grey hair really bad. You. Not really bad, but I've got quite a few. Do you want to drink? Anyway, I'm going because Jimmy is totally winding me up and I can't film anything. <laughs> Do you want a drink? You're a nightmare. I'm sorry. You're actually worse than Jesse. I'm sorry. Do you want a drink? I can't just sit in peace and film an introduction. Do you want to drink? Uh, go on then. Nest Cafe? Nest Cafe, yeah. <laughs> right, so I'll bring you all along. <laughs> I'll bring you all along to my hair doing and uh, have a nice little hair transformation. Right, guys, the day is on. Looking so cool right now. <laughs> I'm just so excited. We're going a little bit darker. Um, just to freshen everything up really because it was just in good need of a freshen up but um yeah look how gorgeous the salon is i just love it here so much um, and i always bang on about chantelle every time i come here but she is amazing so if you are in the barnsley area you need to come to chantelle for your hair doing because she's just so good um so yeah just leaving this on um and then uh, it'll be time to wash it out my favorite bit and then um 
yeah, have a nice cut, although I don't need that much taken off actually because my hair's quite healthy, which is good. Um, and then it's farm time with Jesse. Can't wait to see him. Oh my god, that looks so good! I'm so happy with it. Oh my god, it looks like it's not my hair. <laughs> it looks fake. Oh my god, it does! In a good way, it yeah. looks fake. Oh my god, I love it so much. Wow. There we go. Right, here's the hair. Kind of blends in with my top. So you can't really see. Let's have a look. Let me pull it forward a bit. Oh, I just feel so much better. I absolutely love it. It's been so long and it's just needed been doing so bad. Um, let's see if you can see here. You can't really see it to be honest. Um, but yeah, I'm so happy with it. Um, I need to go like now because um, mum, dad, not mum, dad, <laughs> mum, Jesse, and my brother are on the way to the farm. So I need to go now to meet up with them and see a little man i've missed him so much i can't wait to see him yeah i'm so excited to see his little face bless him they're feeding the meerkats at two o'clock um so i can't wait to see his little face uh, but yeah i've just come out for a little freshen up i'm just going to put some perfume on just start freshen up a little bit um and yeah let's go to the farm hello i missed you what you've been looking at the cows <laughs> oh i like yeah Liv. do you like it oh, duck duck good boy that's a bird Come on then. But close. <gasps> We're going to the farm! Ah! <laughs> what have you seen? What is it? Oh, are you so excited? Are you so excited? Yeah. Jessie's found the meerkats already. Mm. Jessie, where's your sticker? Mm. Where's your sticker? Mm. Yeah, mm. meerkat. Mm. And what's that? Jessie, what's this? Pig pig! Oh, is it? <laughs> a quick snack before we go in. Someone's not in best moods because he's tired. <laughs> You've been lovely, haven't you? Mama, yeah, I'm here. What is it? Is it a horsey? Wow! Hey, hello! Oh, he's going to need to tuck his vest in. Look, let Nanan show you. What is it? Turn around. Can you see those guinea pigs? Look up here, Jesse. Here, look, hold on his hand. Let's go and find it. <laughs> Have you spotted it? Whoa, look. Say hi. Wow! Oh, look, it's coming up to you. Hello, Papa. Say hello. Good boy. There's another one down here. Look at them bunny rabbits. Shh, oh, they're sleeping. Oh. Feed the goats. He's asking for more. <gasps> Look, goats coming, Jesse. You see it? It's coming. Jesse, watch. Hello, goaty. Yeah. Jesse, do it. What is it? He'll just throw it in. Look. Good boy, Neely. Bye. Bye. <laughs> Yay. Nice sheep. Is anyone else terrified of llama? I can't go over there because I'm sure one spat at me once. It can at all. So I'm just too scared to go over there. 
just too scary but Jesse's not bothered look at him he's straight in he is so excited to be here he's like unbelievably excited say hi llama oh my goodness is it your favorite meerkats wow oh look at them ones asleep together oh my god just look at that how cute oh my god i can't cope with them sleeping together to be fed. Ready, wait for me your cats. Ready. <gasps> Ready, the Ready. images Ready. are coming. Yeah. Ready. <gasps> there he is! Can you see him? Oh, oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no, they're being fed. Oh, look at him. Whoa. <laughs> now home been home a while actually it's quite uh late well not late but it's like i'm sure it's nearly seven o'clock um we got home and jesse has had the longest nap ever which is so bad <laughs> like the worst danger nap ever because now he's going to be up all night although he's still quite tired he's just upstairs with jimmy at minute because we're all home now um so i came home managed to edit a full vlog um, get it uploaded and everything which is amazing honestly I'm loving so much being active on social media again it's just made me miss so much being like off work what what are we gonna get your meerkat toy can you remember Nana bought you a new meerkat toy he is just totally and utterly obsessed with animals no we don't jump from there hold on his hand hold on his hand Okay, no worries. Right, go on then, ready? Woohoo! Let's shut the gate. There we go. Right, shall mummy get your meerkat toy? And you can show everybody what you chose at the farm. Yeah? Yeah, that little farm was so lovely. He had the best time ever. Didn't you? Although, he is a little bit upset now. I just think it's because he was out of routine a bit, not having a nap through the day and having a bit of a later nap. Yeah, he's not in the best of mood, are you? But we're going to put a sticker on Mia Cat, on your Mia Cat toy. Wow. Uh oh. Mummy, do it ready. Whoa. He's <gasps> matching you. Your little Mia Cat. So now you've got two Mia Cat toys, Jesse. Are well, you giving him all, all of them? Go on then, stick them on. Wow. You gonna show everyone your sticker? Stick. Stick, yeah. Stick. <laughs> Bless. He's honestly, he's saying so many words now, it's crazy. Um, we can't say two words at one time though, can we? But that's okay, we'll, we'll get there. Where's he gone? Where's he gone? <coughs> oh, you've got a sticker stuck to you. No one can see your pretty face. I've got your back turned to everybody, but I reckon if you turn around and saw camera, he'd just like totally knock it over wouldn't you you got a sticker on your ear now um anyway guys i'm so excited because oh thank you i'm so <laughs> i'm so excited because this weekend we're going to get the cabinets from ikea for the bedroom when i just can't wait it will be a separate vlog because i think i'm just gonna do like a full-on like um nursery tran well, i said nursery it's just more like a bedroom uh, bedroom transformation um i'm not I'm, I'm not doing the panelling anymore. I think in my last video I said I was going to do the panelling. I'm not doing it because it's that small up there. We, we wouldn't even be able to like move furniture to get round to do the panelling. So we're doing the yeah. panelling somewhere else. Whoa, that's so cool. Um, and I'm just going to put some new... <laughs> I'm just going to put some new shelves up. Uh, we've got a new cabinet. 
well we were like oh no give mummy that sticker we're now eating stickers um so we're gonna get that this weekend um i've only just told jimmy that we're doing that so yeah uh, he will probably end up forgetting that <laughs> um but yeah i've just been in jesse's room and i've just thought i'm so excited to get my hands on it and get it sorted i have more storage i need to order a blind as well but i need to order some samples because i'm not sure what color i want um but i also i'm going to pick up some new shelves um, and I'm just so excited to make it like a nicer room for me to go in and I mean barely anyone goes in that room and I want to change that because um, it was the same when Jesse was newborn we barely went in that room like didn't even get him changed in there um, we had like a changing mat and everything and we didn't use it and I, this time I want to use it more because it is, it is a cute space it is really cute yeah I can't wait so I'll show you me oh have you got your scooter? Whoa, we borrowed that from Grandma's house while she's on holiday, haven't we? But it needs to go back. Yeah, because that, that's the scooter for Grandma's house, that. So, yeah, everything on here is what needs to go in the drawers, basically. So, I've got lots of organising to do, but I'm so excited to do it. Stick. Oh, my goodness, it's on Mummy's trousers. How did it get there? Ready? Whoa. So yeah, these are all Jessie's clothes. That was in the last vlog, if you watched that. Um, Jessie's old clothes. That's only like first size in a few zero to three month stuff. This is all new stuff I've bought. We've got nappy caddy, hospital bag, bits from mamas and papas, Christmas clothes from Jessie. We've got the prep machine here. And it's just like taking over the conservatory, which isn't a problem, to be honest. But I just want to get organised now. I just can't wait to get in that room and just just get it blitzed so i don't know if i'll get a chance to do it tomorrow whoa you got your meerkat should we get your other meerkat toy yeah oh are you doing the simba thing oh that's so cute are you lifting meerkat up like simba yeah wow that's so cool dancing jesse <laughs> Whoa! So yeah, I don't think I'm gonna get a chance to sort it out tomorrow because obviously. Oh, right. You want me to show them again? Go on then. Whoa! Should we get your other animal toys? Sorry, I'm, I'm. I'll go back to my topic of conversation after I've um. After I've given him his toys, Jesse, look. Look, you've now got two Mia Cat toys. Look, Mummy Mia Cat and Baby Mia Cat. And then you've got a little Simba, which is actually a leopard, but it really looks like Simba. And your giraffe. Haven't you? I don't know if I've mentioned this, but we have had a total obsession with Lion King recently. Jessie is totally... Oh. <laughs> I can't cope. I just can't cope. That is so cute, Get Jessie. Down. Get down, Mia Cat. Get down. Yeah, we have watched Lion King probably about 100 times in the past two weeks. Ever since we went to Yorkshire Wildlife Park for Father's Day, he has been obsessed with animals and Lion King. Wow! Oh, Mia Cat's in the mug. <laughs> oh, full. He is just totally loving life with his animals, aren't you? Totally loving life. But because he's obsessed with animals, naturally I've had to like buy him anything with animals on it. So I found this sleep suit, which is actually, I think it's Sam Fair's range um, in Tesco. I didn't even realise she was bringing one out. And it's just got all these animals over it, like this sleep suit. And he loves it so much. I think it was about £10. But yeah, he loves it. And he can send monkey really good. Jesse, can you say monkey? <laughs> oh, you made the noise. That was good enough. Well done. But yeah, look at him. He's just, honestly, he's just growing up so quick and all these like new milestones is just killing me. And I'm just so excited for, for to see him be a big brother. I'm just so, so excited. Uh, but plans for the rest of the night are to just have a chill, basically. Because I've tidied the house yesterday, um, I, uh, I've got nothing to do tonight, which is lovely. Although I have got a massive washing pile that I could do with getting down. Um, and I also need to get prepped for tomorrow night, seeing as we're going out, aren't we? Well, you're not, but me and Daddy are, which is going to be nice. Yeah? So we're just going to have a chill now. Do you want to watch Lion King? Do you want to watch Lion King? He normally gets excited and says, yeah, but he's not playing ball yeah. now. Lion King? Say bye to the vlog then for now, and we'll see him a bit later. Say bye. Ah! You heard a car outside. Right, say bye. Bye. Bye.
Are we watching Christmas vlogs in July? Yes, we are. Good morning, everybody. It's now the next day. I realised I didn't even finish off the vlog last night. Um, obviously, I'm carrying on today anyway. But I didn't, like, close it off. Um, we didn't do anything special. We just went to bed. <laughs> we had a good night's sleep. Jessie was super fidgety last night. Um, Jimmy's gone off to work this morning. And I have treated me and Jessie to a Starbucks. Um, and I can't wait. I'm so excited because I feel like I've not had Starbucks in ages even though I had one last week. Yeah, I'll just do a little Starbucks haul of what we got. So I just got myself a latte. I'm just going to put some sugar in that. I got Jessie um, the egg bites with three cheese and ham. Now, these are absolutely gorgeous. I bought them once when... Uh, when Jesse first started eating and I tried them and I thought oh my god they're amazing so I got him them because he does like them I got myself a cheese toasty we've got a cinnamon swirl and a chocolate twist so I'm just going to plate Jesse's up now he's going to love these I can't wait to give him him and yeah I'm just excited for some coffee and some food and to chill all day with my little boy I'm so excited um, but yeah we're out tonight aren't we I mentioned that yesterday which I'm looking forward to I'm looking forward to putting some makeup on and feeling half decent because I feel like all the vlogs recently have just looked like this which is not a problem um but yeah we've watched Zoella this morning and then I just I, you just can't put a Zoella vlog on without watching all her autumn and Christmas ones and they're just my favorite ones in the world because they just make you feel some kind of way I don't know what it is I just feel so whole when I watch her autumn and Christmas vlogs Weird, I know. But anyway, Mister, are you going to say morning to everybody? You could not see anything. Morning. Morning, everybody. Are you going to have some breakfast? We'll see what happens. Yeah. Come on then. Morning. Hot. Mmm. You're going to love these. being the worst vlogger in the world today <laughs> it's a bit late well it's way later on now it's about 10 past four um i was planning earlier to take you all upstairs and start on jesse's room and get it all cleared out when he fell asleep but he fell asleep on me and then i thought do i stay here and go to, for a little nap myself or do i put him down and i just thought you know what we've got four months left basically three months left of it just me and him and his dad um it's very rare that i'm gonna get a chance for him to sleep on me again and cuddle up to him so i thought i'm staying put so i stayed there and had like an hour's sleep with him <laughs> and then he carried on um sleeping and i did loads of washing which i'm super proud of myself for look at all that i also went upstairs put the bedding on um i tidied the kitchen i should have filmed all this but do you know like when you're in the moment and you're just like if i stop i'm not gonna get back up um and yeah so now i'm just getting ready to um pack his stuff for him to go to my mum's house tonight so he's super tired today he's really really tired um so i think he'll be hopefully good as gold tonight but i've just got him changed into these this little outfit from tesco it's so cute my mum and dad bought him some like playing clothes for when they when he goes to their house uh, that he can get mucky and stuff and he came home in these ones last time so i'm putting them in him today i've put them in i've put him in them so she can keep him but i just think they're so cute it's this little leopard print i just think he looks adorable in it i think he looks proper cute anyway i've started to get some bits out ready to pack i've got two vests uh some pajamas i just need some clothes for tomorrow for him it says it's gonna be nice weather tomorrow jimmy's finished work are you all right? What you doing? Oh no! You don't want me to kiss it? Yeah. 
Let me kiss you. Um, Jimmy's finished work early, which is amazing because I can get in the shower now and start getting ready. Well, he's not home yet, but he, he was going to finish later than he has. So he's on his way home now, I think, which is fab. Um, and then we're going to get ready and go out tonight, which I can't wait for. I'm so excited. Uh, I sent Jimmy what kind of food is there. Oh my god, and I just cannot bloody wait for it. So that'll be really nice, and the weather's turned out nice as well because it's been raining all week. So I think now I'm just going to get Jesse's bag together, get him all sorted so that I can jump straight into the shower and get myself sorted. I don't even know what I'm wearing yet. Um, and yeah, I'm looking forward to it. Oh, so yeah, fresh bedding all on, which is just a dream. I cannot wait to jump into that bed tonight. It's smelling so fresh in here as well because I've got the plugins and they're absolutely amazing. My favourite of the plugins is, I think it's cotton linen and lilac, cotton linen and lilac or something. It's insane. It is amazing. So I've got the plug in there and then I've also got the diffuser of it in the bathroom and it's just so gorgeous. So yeah, it's the Airwick ones. Cotton fresh or cotton linen and lilac. Crisp linen and lilac. That's what it is. Crisp linen and lilac. So yeah, this is what I wanted to do today guys and I've just not got round to doing it, which is a shame really. But I did this ages ago. That's a full bag for charity. This is all of Jessie's clothes, which I need to go through because, like, from here onwards, they're just not fitting anymore. Um, it, the drawer's still broke. <laughs> and, yeah, I need a blind desperately. But, yeah, we're going to get two shelves to go over here. The new cabinet is coming down here. It's still going to be a tight squeeze, but I don't care because it don't matter at all. But, yeah, it just needs a good clean and a good sort out um, whilst I'm up here, actually. Let me get him his clothes for tomorrow, so I'm all sorted. There's just stuff everywhere and I just don't know, like, do you know when the, you just don't feel like even it moved to come and get him some clothes out because of how bad it is? There's just stuff everywhere. But anyway, let me pick him an outfit out for tomorrow. I've also got some clothes I need to send back to nursery because I always forget to pack spare clothes, always, whether it's nursery or whether it's, um, like, just going out for the day. I always forget to pack spare clothes. And, um, like, the last three times I've had to change them into clothes that they've got because I've not spent sent spares. Um, so I've had to wash them and uh, I need to make sure they go back. Right, I'm going to give him some shorts. And let's have a look. I might put him in yellow tomorrow. This is a little top from Tesco. Just with some grey shorts from Tesco. It's going to be nice and sunny, so I'll pack him those. Pop a little cardigan in as well. But I don't think he's staying there massively long tomorrow because um, mum and dad are going to drop him off first thing tomorrow because I will have missed him far too much. <laughs> but yeah, I can pack his stuff now. I've also just popped both of his eczema creams in there too um, because it's quite bad at the minute. Who's here? Who is it? I'm going to wait for him. Is dad at home? Ready, ta. <gasps> Is that daddy? <gasps> Yay! Daddy's home! <laughs> Hello. Dada's home for Jesse. Yeah. Even dance. though he's leaving soon. Jesse, you gonna dance for daddy? Woohoo! He's quite tired actually, so he's probably not in the mood to dance, are you? <laughs> oh no, what's up? Anyway, Jess is all packed to go now. Um, Mum will be here in about 20 minutes. So, yeah, I don't know what's up with him. I think someone's just super tired. You are you just super tired? Uh, yeah. Hi everyone, Jessie has now gone to my mum's, she's just picked him up and I'm going to get ready. Please ignore the mess behind me because this room is just the worst room in the house, it's so bad. Um, but I'm going to get ready anyway, I don't think I'm in a rush, let's have a look at what time actually is it. Oh no, not too bad, so I can take my time which is nice because usually I'm rushing about. I've been in the shower already, just put some PJs on. Um, and yeah, I'm just gonna do my normal makeup, just the usual. And yeah, let's go.
ready so I thought I would quickly show you my outfit. I've just gone for the dress because I just don't know what to wear so um, oh, let me just pull it down a little bit. So it's this gorgeous dress from Miss Selfridge but it's actually ASOS. It's not maternity. Um, I think the underlining I need to pull down a bit. Yeah, it's not maternity. I just got it in a size 16. I could have done with 14 to be honest, but as you can see, it's very stretchy. So fits around the bump perfectly. This is the bump at 24 plus six. I'm 25 weeks tomorrow, which is crazy. Oh my God. But yeah, I just, it's really comfy. It's really nice to throw on. Um, and I think I'll feel comfortable in it all night. I'm just gonna pair it with a denim jacket to tone it down a little bit because I don't want to look too dressy but I want to feel nice because um, it's not often I get to dress up pretty. Yeah, I'm just going to throw it on with a denim jacket and some sandals and probably by the end of the night I'll have food all down it and drink all down it because I just can't have a meal without getting food down me. But yeah, I love the dress. I'll link it down below for you if it's still in stock. Hopefully it is. I did buy it a while ago and it's the first time I've wore it. Um, so yeah, let's go get some tasty food. Boys are just checking out Lee's new car. So it looks like I'm waiting even longer for my food. Oh! <laughs> Not <laughs> <laughs> Sorry I've not filmed much, it was too loud in there to film anything. She's a <laughs> it's a rubbish vlogger. I actually said that earlier so I can't disagree with you. But it was lovely, really, really nice. I'm just aching so bad. It's unreal. Everyone's been on gin and nice fruit ciders and I've had two cokes and a water. So yeah, but it's been lovely. I can't believe I lasted this long actually, because I thought an hour in I thought, oh my god, I need to go because I'm tired, but now it's nearly ten o'clock. Met and we met Tyson Fury. <laughs> it were Tyson Fury. Who else did we meet? Um, is that it? No, that were it. Oh, Tyson Fury's dad. <laughs> Tyson Fury's dad. Honestly, they're absolutely crazy. I can't quote with mom. Um, but yeah, because I've been sat down for so long, I'm aching. Unbelievably glad. Jimmy, have you enjoyed yourself? Good. Yeah. You really enjoyed it? It's been nice, hasn't it? It's been great. Night's home time in bed and I can't wait. I'm trying to bribe Jimmy to either go to Ikea or pram shopping tomorrow, but he's not on board with any of them. Are you talking to Matilda? No, it's a vlog. <laughs> <laughs> Why are you just doing First sign of madness, that live talking because to yourself. I wanted to go and get cabinets tomorrow from Ikea and Jimmy says no. So then I said, let's do pram shopping instead. And he said, talk to me tomorrow. <laughs> anyone else's boyfriend like that he's terrible and to be honest if we made plans tonight I'd forget about him anyway um, but yeah I'm gonna go home now get into bed I can't wait um, yeah it's been a nice night look who's home you say hello no right <laughs> everyone I thought I'd carry on this vlog today because I don't think I got much filmed yesterday and plus today's gonna be nice but well I said today it's one o'clock uh, we're gonna go look for a pram for new baby boy so I've been backward and forward constantly ever since I found out I was pregnant on whether to get a double pram or a single pram and everyone told me to get a double and then everyone was saying a double's a waste of money so like, I don't know what to do so we were gonna get the bugaboo donkey five which was £1,900 for a double pram which turns into a single a nice fixed base and a car seat obviously a very lot of money um and then i thought do you know what do we actually need a double pram because there's a significant difference between buying a bugaboo donkey for 1900 pound and just buying a single pram now i'm not just doing it because of price the main reason is is because jesse just hates the pram i don't know if anyone remembers but literally four months ago i went to mamas and papas and bought him a brand new stroller the armadillo stroller which is lovely and he's been in it a handful of times 
Um, when we went to Yorkshire Wildlife Park for Father's Day, you'll notice in the clips, my mum is pushing around an empty pram for the full five hours we were there because he refused to get in it. He wanted to walk the whole time. And I actually had to force him to get into the pram and try and have a nap and he was screaming his head off. So I'll, he was in there for what? 15 seconds and he had to come out because he, he, he was too upset. He didn't want to be in pram, he wanted to walk. Same as when we went to Meadowall. He didn't want to go in pram, he wants to walk. Um, where else have we been? And he, he just, he, he doesn't want to go in the pram. Oh, farm other day. He don't want to be in a pram going to a farm. He wants to be walking about. So I'm just thinking, is there any point in buying a double pram for that much? I know he can get ones cheaper. Um, when he's not going to go in it. And my main reason for getting a double was that, well, what am I going to do when I'm on my own? But when I'm on my own, he's not going to want to go in a pram, is he? So... Um, we're gonna go for a single pram today. Hopefully one that already has a buggy board on the pram. If not, we'll buy one. Um, because I know you can buy extenders for mamas and papas prams. Um, but then also, I forgot your name, I'm so sorry. A lovely lady sent me a, like, um, you know the reins? He, he goes on the reins with his gran and sometimes we use them. But you can get reins that attach to the pram. Um, and it's the cutest thing in the world I've ever seen. And I was thinking, well, if I'm on my own, um, I can just use them. So we're going to do that. And then I've said to Jimmy, if it gets to it, when baby boy arrives and we think, oh, crap, we could actually do a double pram. I'll just see if we can get like a cheap one for like 100 quid or something on, um, on Marketplace. Uh, but I think we won't need a double pram personally. And if we do go out all together for a full day, and he needs a pram. Me and Jimmy, will just, we've still got the mamas and papas stroller. We'll just have to push one each. What are you doing? Over there. Is daddy tickling you? Yeah, so I'm going. We're going to the pram shop. It's one in Barnsley. Um, and it sells mamas and papas prams. It sells all of them. If it was up to me, I would want an eye candy. But I know they're very expensive as well. Like nearly as much as the bugaboo. Um... <laughs> But I actually don't know what I want because I also really love the mums and papas ones. But when we went for Jesse, we went in knowing what we wanted because I was sat on the Venice and I loved the Venice so much. Jesse's Venice pram was amazing. But he still uses that at his grands. Um... <laughs> so anyway, bottom line is we're going to have a look for a pram today. <laughs> Ready? <laughs> Bless him. So, Jesse, are you going to help choose a pram for your baby brother? Fine. <laughs> Jimmy, what kind of pram are you wanting? A cheap one. <laughs> a cheap one. <laughs> I know. It's why they're all so expensive these days, Can't aren't they? It's ridiculous. Over a thousand pound for a bloody push chair. Oh my god. Well, actually, it's a travel system. You get the car seat included. I'm oh, sorry, a travel system. Anyway, we don't even know what that prices we're so looking at yet, better. Jimmy. Right, we're here. Last time Jesse were here, he was in my tummy. We're always still looking so independent. Don't even want to hold dad's hand. Are we going to have a look at some prams for your little brother? We're galloping. Oh god, here we go. <laughs> this way, mister. I love this one so much. I think it's eye candy cookie. Um, but Jimmy's just said he likes this one, which is a mamas and papas one, and I think that is absolutely gorgeous. So we're going to have a look at that one. I think, what's this one? Is it knocked? Mamas and papas nocturne. Well, that's real. Oh, it's in a car row. Yeah, I like that one. I love the colour. Um, I just need to see if it comes with any bundles with car seats. But I think that's gorgeous, that. I mean, it's similar to what we had with Jesse, but yeah, it's exactly the same. yeah, but it's not as big and uh, the Venice one. I don't know where's the Venice one here. Wait. Oh, that's what we had with Jesse, I think. Right, I think we're gonna go for the for this one. Um, you what? You get in the mitts as well. I just love this one. I really love it, um, and I just keep going back to it. Yeah, I know. Oh, that's nice. Right, this is it. More two vibes. What do we think? I really love it. And it comes with a blanket. <laughs> wow. <laughs> it's 500 pounds there. You're being shattered. It zooms in slower, this, Yeah, it, it? does. <laughs> it zooms in really slow. Whoa, hello. Oh. 
<laughs> really knocked me off. Eh? Good boy. Good boy. I love it. Yeah? Go on then, get it. Really like it. <laughs> right. Go on then. You have to live it then. I mean, it's a pram, yeah. You're not bothered, are you? I'm really at not all. bothered at all. What are you doing? Give up. So I'm so sorry I didn't finish the vlog. Um, but after the, we went pram shopping, we went out for some dinner. It was so lovely. Um, and then I've come to edit the vlog and realised I didn't finish it off. So yeah, just an update. We did go for the Acaro in Nocturne, and I'm so happy we went for that one. I was really debating between the Strada. I think I showed the Strada and the Acaro. Uh, Jimmy really wanted the Strada because it was next display, so it was like really super cheap for the full bundle. Um, but I just, my eyes kept going back to that Acaro, um, and it's just so gorgeous, and I can't wait for it to come. It's going to be early October when it arrives. Um, so yeah, I'm just so excited uh, and very happy we went for that one. Um, I've done a little TikTok and loads of you have said that you've had an Acaro and love it, which is amazing. I have had some messages asking why we're just not using Jessie's one because it's similar and it is. The colour's the exact same one as Jessie's, um, but it's a total different brand. We had Venici for Jessie um, and this one's obviously Mams and Papas. And I wanted a new car seat as well. Um, because I wasn't too happy with Jesse's car seat. So we've got the Cybex Cloud T um, this time, which I'm super excited for. So yeah, um, I mean, I, just, I don't really have to explain myself why we've got a new pram. I'd, we just wanted a new pram. And plus, um, Jesse actually still uses the Venici one at his grand's that that pram stays up there so the base the for the for frame and everything is all up at his grand's because she uses that wednesday thursday friday when they go for their walks um when i'm at work so it's still in use and um you know if we weren't using it then i would have just probably gave it away um so yeah we, we've got a new pram <laughs> but yeah i'm so excited for it to come i can't wait and the bag that it comes with is gorgeous i'm just so excited for a bag and it comes with a little blanket as well and i just can't wait i'm so excited so yeah i hope you all enjoyed this vlog um another one will be coming super soon i was supposed to be filming one today but jimmy's dragging me out to go and look at a car so today jess is at nursery and i had the full day plan to go up into his room and proper gut it get rid of all his um, clothes that don't fit him anymore, put into piles what I want to keep for when new baby boy's in it, that close size. Uh, and then Jimmy's like, please, will you come with me? Please, will you come with me? So now my full day has been taken up by going to look at a car. Um, so yeah, that's what we're doing today. So the, the next vlog will probably be me sorting Jess's room out, but I'm gonna have to do that tomorrow instead now. But anyway, just thought I'd give you a little update on what's to come. <laughs> uh, thank you all so much for watching and I'll see you in my next video. Bye. I've been saying I've been